the movement is the heartbeat of a watch. Today, let's compare two popular quartz movements, the Seiko VH31 and the Miyota 2035. Both are excellent, but they serve different purposes and appeal to different consumers. First up, the Seiko VH31. This movement is known for its smooth sweeping second hand, which beats four times per second. It mimics the look of a mechanical movement, giving your quartz watch a touch of elegance. This makes it to be one of the most popular and widely used quartz movement nowadays. It's perfect for those who admire traditional watch aesthetics, but prefer the hassle-free reliability of quartz. Next, we have the Miyota 2035, a favorite for its simplicity, durability, and affordability. Unlike the VH31, it features a classic ticking second hand that advances once per second. This movement is energy efficient, offering a longer battery life of up to three years. It's an excellent choice for budget-friendly watches and everyday wear. To summarize, the VH31 is ideal for enthusiasts who want the look of a mechanical watch without the need for regular winding or servicing. It combines quartz accuracy with timeless design, though it costs more than 2035 movement, but watches with this movement is price-friendly generally. Meanwhile, the Miyota 2035 prioritizes practicality with longer battery life and a lower cost. So, whether you prefer the elegance of the VH31 or the practicality of the Miyota 2035, there's a perfect quartz movement for everyone. Which one do you prefer?